In this video, we are going to learn about complementary angles. Complementary angles are two angles that add up to 90 degrees. It's important that there is only two angles as opposed to three or more. So for example, I could have this angle, which is 30 degrees, and this angle, which is 60 degrees, and these two angles would be complementary because they add to 90 degrees. Notice that the two angles do not have to be next to each other, as in they don't need to be adjacent and sharing a common ray to be complementary. When two angles are complementary, they are considered to be complements of each other. So these two angles are complements, just a variation of the word complementary. There are two key places where you tend to see complementary angles. One is in a right angle. Because a right angle is 90 degrees, if you take a right angle and divide it into any two angles, those two angles will be complementary to one another. So I could draw a ray anywhere in this inside region and create two complementary angles. So for example, if I draw a ray right here, even though I don't know what measure or what degrees these angles are, they have to be complementary because together they form that right angle. So this is a situation where I know those two angles have to be complementary. The other common place where you will see complementary angles is in right triangles. Right triangles have one right angle. And another thing you need to know is that the angles in a triangle add to 180 degrees. If you have, haven't heard that before, you'll learn about it more later. But the angles add to 180 degrees. So that means that if one angle is already 90 degrees, the other two angles in the triangle have to add to 90 degrees themselves in order to make the total measure of the angles be 180 degrees. That means that the two non-right angles in the triangle are complementary because they have to add up to 90 degrees. So they are complements of each other or they are complementary angles. So those are the two key places where you'll run across complementary angles, either in a situation where you have a right angle that's been divided up, or in this situation where we have a right triangle, the two non-right angles will always be complementary.